Show some more trust in him again. McCarron lost it though. Mark gets a screen from Kay, feeds it in, and the jam from Nick Kay because they couldn't quite retrieve it safely enough. Good. Have a look at that for a part. Barlow up, pressuring full court, and they're getting their hands in there. A oh, handoff from. Well, I'm not sure Matt Jook was expecting it from Kay, but. He put it away anyway. Be able to take a step off Illy and challenge him to be able to make a contested shot. Norton with the handoff, a look away handoff, and Hunt again. So the man who had 12 minutes of court time for no score. Clock winds down for him. Six left, but he likes it like this. Steps it out again. Steindl, three-point specialist. He's been doing it all season. Two, Bryce Cotton retrieves that. Back into the paint, wanted to hand it up. Lost, got back again by Martin, and Hart draws the foul. And here is Trimble again. 25 points and 21 points in those two losses, and Long was hammered. Wagstaff pleads his case. Because Mellow Trimble was just putting his head on the rim, saying that no one can stay in front of him. Great block there by Hunt, but Sean Long following it up as well. In point margin right now. A rubber band stretching. Tarico turns, shoots, it drops, and he'll go to the line. You're really good attacking off the dribble. I'd like to see him back himself there and, and really go at Reese Vay, but on the other end, it's a great pass, great cut, great finish. This one set. This is the one I was talking about with Mitch Norton. Great little scoop pass there. Last couple of weeks for Chris Golding. It's gold fingers again right now. And that's what you do when you've got a rookie on you. Say, young fella, take a little bit of this. And Bryce Cotton straight back at you. A pin down. It was Bryce Cotton, late challenge there. When United bring it down the floor again, Chris Golding poked away. Here we go, one for the highlights reel from Bryce. From the outside, that one's not a bad one, but I like seeing that from Sean Long. Tarico steps it inside, flips it in. That defied physics, but he got it to work. Mate, not, not to be disrespectful, but the boys don't need you at the moment. You're <laughs> jumping up and down on the sidelines. You're loving life. Oh, yeah, I'm loving it, man. Anytime the guys are doing what they're supposed to do on the court. And all the answers so far, Melbourne United. Poked away by Golding. Norton saves the day. Wide to Kay. He is dunking everything lately. He, <laughs> he gets up quick. He doesn't need to be up there very right. long. Up, bang. Got a running Finish. start at that one. These days, the NBL, the NBA, sets some huge comebacks in both comps this season. Tough fade away from Tarico. They look down the other end, and this is his shot. Tarico White, the back to the basket, a little fade away. That's always money. Yeah, you've got to admire so many of the players in this competition just want the ball in their hand, and Mitch Norton with an awesome reverse. Is collected by Clint Stein. Cock to Rico. Closer to. Right, let's put some score pressure on Melbourne United. Loala Chul hands it up. Turnover. Kay. He's got a friend in Tarico. Two on two game. Takes on White, draws the foul. He talks about Mello Trimble coming to play. 21 and 11 now for the big fella in the middle. Steindl with the runner. Desperately needed. Mello didn't play last game against the Wildcats. Had a thumb injury. He's been back in form. Nick Kay gives them some hope for that extra. Vague. Norton. He drops a three. And the crowd still have some.